Hey, welcome to Cosmic Tides. We're going to see how the cosmic currents are pulling for Leo. This is going to be your beginning to middle of January spread. Down below, I will have the timestamp if you want to skip past my talking. Links for my Spotify, Apple Music, and SoundCloud will be down below, as well as my email for $20 personal readings. Due to a high volume of requests, I need at least 2-3 days to get them done after transactions, so I appreciate you for your patience. Also, go check out my spiritual store on Etsy. Link is going to be down below. And make sure to check out my new Instagram. I'm pulling daily tarot cards, sharing channeled messages, spells, talking about energy shifts, and sharing updates on my YouTube channel and Etsy store. So if you guys are interested in all that, you can go follow me at CosmicTides underscore, and that information is going to be down below. And before we begin, just keep in mind that these energies are interchangeable, so feel free to switch around the characters if you need to as we go along. And I'm seeing the number 414 for some of you guys. This can be like April 14th, I'm seeing. And I'm using the Fairy deck with the Modern Witch Tarot deck for you guys today. Okay, I see you guys are walking away from something because uh, you want something more meaningful, spiritual, emotional. You want something with depth. And you realize that it was time to move on and you know something better for you is on the horizon. So I see you walking towards it. It was like you just needed a little push to get going. It's like you guys are on two separate pages. Yeah, this person just wants to have fun and you're more serious. Um, so, like I said, it was like you just needed a little push to get going, to move forward. So I definitely see you close a chapter with this person and start a brand new chapter for yourself. Um, and this person um, feels slighted by this, okay? You're trying to manage your energy wisely when it comes to this person. You're trying to protect your energy. This person kind of feels entitled to your energy, I'm seeing. Entitled to your body. Um, and it's like you used your intuition. You learned your lesson here. And this person doesn't like it, okay? This person doesn't like it. On the outside, they act like they don't care, but on the inside, they do. Like I said, this person's pissed. Um, they feel entitled to your energy. It's like I see this person with their hand out, okay? Um, and I see you're just trying to look to the future with hope and optimism so happy changes can come in to bring relief from challenging times. You just want to receive the blessings from the burdens of the past. You just want to be happy and emotionally fulfilled, Um with people that you can trust and you can't trust this person this person puts you in a third party situation uh, this person still wants you to give to this situation but it's unstable like i said they put you in a third party they just want to have fun um and i see the wheel the karmic wheel is turning in your favor here i see you receiving the blessings from the burdens of this situation um, i see a lot of blessings happening right now i see you in high vibes you're very happy um yeah, you're very happy right now, and I see this person is going to try to resurface here. They're hoping you still have a soft spot for them. Um, yeah, they're hoping that you still have a soft spot for them. This person is in a lot of anxiety right now um, because they see that you're stable. Yeah, they see that you're stable, and they're unstable right now. So this person's going to be offering you a cup of love here, but the only thing is a lot of that love has spilled out already. Um, and this person makes you feel ungrounded. They're in and out, flighty, um, and you don't want to be distracted right now. Yeah, you don't want to be distracted right now from your goals. I'm definitely seeing here a lot of you could be going into a new business opportunity, new career opportunity, something like that. So you could be leaving this person and starting something with your career or getting, yeah, you could be starting something with your career. You could be getting new job offers. Okay, so... I definitely see you're not wanting to be distracted by this person. You're wanting to focus on your goals right now. Your legs are closed. Your hands are to yourself. And this person is thinking about sending you a sexual message here. Your legs are closed. You're cutting this person off because this was unbalanced. Um, because this was unbalanced. This person was juggling here. They didn't take you seriously. And you're trying to get your shit together. You're trying to let go of this to have a commitment to your spiritual growth to keep on moving forward for some of you for some of you i see you're definitely going into like a new business opportunity here um it's like you just needed a little push to get going it's like you were dealing with somebody that's more immature they don't have responsibilities um and it's like they were kind of preventing you from getting the work you needed done from putting your business plans into action or making the career switch you wanted to do um they kind of made you feel at odds with yourself like you were being overly ambitious um and it's like you realized that um, you needed to manage your energy wisely when it comes to this person this person likes to spend a lot they like to go out a lot um, so definitely this person doesn't have like as many responsibilities as you and it's like you realize that you needed to protect your income you need to protect your business ideas you need to protect your energy from this person 
um, so you can put those plans into action. And it's like that was a little push you needed to get going. So I definitely see where you left this connection to go start um, a new endeavor for yourself, um, a new career journey, because you learned your lesson from dealing with this individual. And this person doesn't like it. This person doesn't like it at all. I definitely see where this person can be like younger than you. I'm kind of sensing like a, like a bratty energy from this because this person feels like entitled to your energy. This person's like all about fun and they don't like when you're serious. They don't like when you're talking about work and all that stuff like this person doesn't like that okay so the fact that you're trying to manage your energy wisely when it comes to this person so you could protect uh what you're building for yourself they don't like it they don't like it you're not fun anymore i just heard okay so you're not fun anymore this person definitely could be younger than you i'm seeing yeah they don't like it they're really angry about this on the outside they don't care but on the inside they're an angry snow leopard here Okay, because they feel entitled to the, your energy. I'm seeing someone with their hand out here. So yeah, they don't like that you're being serious, that you don't want to have fun with them anymore, that you don't want to spend money with them anymore. Um, because you're trying to look out for your future. You want to move forward into your future with hope and optimism. So happy changes can come in to bring relief from challenging times. So you want to receive the blessings from the burdens of your past. You want your life to get better. You want to go into this new chapter for yourself and manifest your best life here. You want to be happy, emotionally fulfilled. Okay, um, and this person just wants to have fun. This person just wants to have fun and they still want you to keep on giving to this situation. Even though it's unstable. Yeah, I'm just saying it's like the karmic wheel is turning in your favor here. I see a lot of blessings happening, especially when it comes to your career. You're you're busy thinking about the future. This person is busy feeling slighted by you is what I'm getting. Yeah, because you don't want to have fun anymore, I just heard. Yeah, because you don't want to have fun anymore, okay? So this person doesn't like it. This person has a lot of anxiety right now because they see that you want to be stable and this person loves having fun with you, okay? So this person loves having fun with you is what I'm seeing here. But you're not wanting to be distracted right now from your goals. Yeah, you're not wanting to be distracted right now from your goals. Uh, so I definitely see this person's thinking about sending you a message here because, like, again, it's like your your arms are crossed here. It's like you're not in the mood to, to play games, to have fun, I'm seeing, okay? Very, like, childlike energy here. Um, and like I said, it's like you're you're very much career fo focused right now, focused on your goals. Um, and this person is thinking about sending you a message here. They want to have fun, but they see you being all serious and stuff. Um, yeah, it's like you, you're serious right now. You're not entertaining this person right now because this was not an equal energy exchange. This person makes you juggle your responsibilities and you're just trying to get your shit together right now. You're trying to get your affairs in order. You're trying to have this commitment to your spiritual growth to keep on moving forward, to put your business plans into action is what I'm seeing. So this person doesn't like it. This person doesn't like that you don't want to have fun anymore. This could be like a friend thing too, um, I'm seeing, okay? So if this is like a friend scenario, you might want to check out the Aries and Aquarius video. Because I'm also seeing, I was also seeing that with them too. For others of you, I'm just seeing like you could have been dating someone who is just like younger, who doesn't have as many responsibilities as you, I'm seeing, okay? So that could have been it too. Um, there's like a whole bunch of scenarios up in here. So um, yeah, take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Please do not force feed the reading. This is not going to resonate with everybody, especially as the channel is growing. Some signs you could be dealing with here. I see Taurus. Taurus, Libra, Aquarius, uh, Taurus, Aquarius, Scorpio, uh, Leo, Pisces, Capricorn, Scorpio, Cancer, with air in their chart, chart or an air sign with Cancer in their chart. Could also be a Pisces moon, Libra, Gemini. Virgo. Okay, so I'm going to leave that there. Hope that was good for you guys. Make sure you check your chart. Whoever you're connecting with, check their chart too. Also, check out my Instagram at Cosmic Tides underscore. I pull daily tarot cards, channel messages, all that good stuff. Also, check out my spiritual store on Etsy. Link is going to be down below. And check out my music on all major platforms and SoundCloud. Links are also going to be down below. I will catch you guys next week, okay? Bye!